Hi, it's Ryan from Ryan Fowler Photography again. I'm just going to give you a quick tutorial on how to uh, post a panorama on Instagram in three separate sections so that it comes up looking uh, once this loads. So it ends up looking something like these in the middle here. Um, as a full panorama. So I've got my panorama here and as you can see it's a fairly decent size. So I'm going to choose the element of it that I really want to portray. So I want to, I want to get from roughly there to pretty much there where my little logo ends. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to post in three parts starting from the furthest away part um, so you uh, you want to start it from right to left as if you're writing like like you're in China or something um, you want it from right to left so that it comes across in that entire format like I told you so um, once you've framed your shot um, just hit next and then you can go through choose any filters you want to put on there and just for hashtags I'm just going to put uh, pano And then part one, I'll just hit OK. Um, I've got a list of hashtags saved in notes that I'll go through and add on to the comments a bit later. You can tag anyone you want, um, name the location. So this was taken at O'Reilly's, there it is. And normally I'd share a photo to Facebook, but because this is going to come up in three parts, I've actually just posted the uh, panorama to Ryan to the Ryan Fowler Photography Facebook page. If you want to go check it out, please do. Um, so I'll post this as one full panorama instead of in three parts um, because it comes up backwards on Facebook if you do it that way. So I'm just going to go share. Okay. And then I'll go to this one. So that's where that last one stopped at the logo. So so about there, so I'll start the next section right about there and then from those leaves I can get to pretty much the spot that I wanted. Um, it won't be exact because uh, it is a bit of a pain posting panoramas on Instagram but they do look really cool when you do post them. So I'll go hashtag pano, okay, panorama and then I'll just do part two and I'll name the location again. So Riley's, there we are, and share. Now for third and final part three. So the last one I posted was about there, I think. It, it'll look roughly the same anyway, and then just hit next, next, or add any of your filters. I always edit in Lightroom, so um, I really only just use normal mode on Instagram because it's already been edited and I don't really want to add any more sections. So I'll hit share again. So now if I go to my profile, you can see my entire panorama all laid out there. It does look a bit, um, I did get it a little bit off this one, I, this uh, middle one here, I got a bit better, but um, yeah, the uh, panorama comes out looking pretty good. Um, it, you can only see it on a small screen. It does look pretty similar to this on the actual Instagram website as well. Uh, so once you get the hang of it, it's pretty easy to nail the entire process. And it's pretty quick to do as well. All right, so I hope you've enjoyed that. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you want to see more. Um, I've also got lots of other videos, including GoPro footage and uh, other tutorials uh, used with cameras and Lightroom and things like that. So if you want to check out my YouTube channel, please do and make sure you subscribe. Thanks. Bye.